Google is trying to make AR play a more useful role in our lives and is doing so by adding three new features to its Lens app. We took a closer look here at Google I.O. 2018. Let's check it out. First up, my favorite and possibly the coolest of the three new features is smart text selection. Basically, this lets you interact with the words in your environment around you through your camera. So you can take a photo of, say, a menu or the inside cover of a book and be able to just highlight the text right from that picture itself and do whatever you want with it. So Google search or do a translation. And with a menu, for example, you can also just find out what individual dishes are. So if you don't know what a duck confit is, take a picture of the menu and just click it and Google will tell you exactly what that is. Another new feature is Style Match, which has you pointing your phone's camera at things like clothes or nice pieces of furniture that you like and not just find the exact item but really find stuff that is in that style that has similar patterns, textures or shapes. Therefore, you're not buying the exact same item as the person that you saw in the real world. You're looking for something that suits your taste. This worked pretty well in our demo. It picked out not only items that look very similar but also the exact original item as well. The third feature is not so much a standalone feature per se, it's called real-time results. It basically uses a combination of machine learning, cloud TPUs, which is tensor processing units, just to kind of speed up the overall experience and also help the phone learn faster because all of that is being conducted on the device. Google today also announced that the lens camera is going to be built into the native camera apps of the Pixel phones as well as the LG G7. And that's what we saw here at our demo today on the LG G7. All you have to do is go to the camera app and tap the Google Lens button at the bottom of the viewfinder to pull up the AI camera. It's also going to be embedded into the native camera app of other major Android phones later this year. So that's very similar to how the Galaxy S9's camera app lets you access Bixby Vision from the same page as well. Like I said before, my favorite of the lot is the Smart Text Selection tool, which actually seems to provide a real benefit. However, the rest just kind of seem like a small update, and we really won't know how useful they really are in the real world until we get to spend more time with the features. But in the meantime, stay tuned to Engadget.com for more out of Google I.O. 2018.